discount selling price marked price discount commission commission agent and some problem based on it mr and mrs deshmukh wants to sell their house in nagpur and shift to mumbai as they are transferred for that they surveyed about the market price of their house which was 35 lakhs as per their survey report they wanted to sell the house immediately so they were ready to sell the house to such a customer who would be ready to buy in cash the cost of house was 35 lakhs if someone was ready to purchase on cash basis they were ready to sell it for rupees 32 lakhs on spots as the house was being sold in cash mr deshmukh offered discount of 3 lakhs to the purchaser as they wanted to sell the house immediately they appointed a middleman who agreed to help them in selling the house charging them 2% commission on selling price of house for which mr deshmukh agreed if silver buys an atom he pays some money for an atom the price he pays is called cost price that is cp the price decided by seller to sell an atom is called marked price that is mp and if he sells that atom to the customer the money he gets against an atom is called as selling price that is sp discount discount is the difference between marked price and selling price finding discount deepak saw a pair of shoe marked at rupees 840 shopkeeper sold the pair to him for rupees 714 what is the discount shopkeeper gave him and what is the discount percentage let us find first discount in rupees it will be marked price minus selling price hence we get rupees 126 discount in rupees now on marked price of rupees 840 the discount is rupees 126 on marked price of rupees 100 the discount is x the discount in percent is 15% finding marked price a shopkeeper sold a fan for rupees 1128 after giving a 6% discount what was its marked price we have given selling price of fan is rupees 1128 and discount is 6% suppose the marked price is rupees 100 the discount is rupees 6 so the selling price is 100 minus 6 that is rupees 94 suppose the actual price of fan is rupees x when the selling price is rupees 94 the marked price is rupees 100 and when the selling price is rupees 1128 the marked price is rupees x this example is of direct proportion if we perform some calculation we get the marked price is rupees 1200 hence the marked price of fan was rupees 1200 pankaj rao sold his house through a commission agent the price of the house was finalized at rupees 4 lakhs 50000 and he had to pay a commission of 2% how much money did he actually get on the selling of the house from above story we now understand the final price of house was rupees 4 lakhs 50000 pankaj rao agreed to pay 2% commission to the commission agent we have given that the percent of commission is 2% means he got rupees 2 on rupees 100 and the price of the house was rupees 4 lakhs 50000 what was its commission on rupees 4 lakhs 
So we take this condition as x. This is an example of direct proportion. As the one value increases, the other will also increases or vice versa. Now arrange the information in this form. If we perform some calculation, we get the commission is rupees nine thousand. Now we have to find the value Pankaj Rao got after paying the commission to the commission agent. So for this, we subtract the commission from selling price of the house. So required money became the actual price that Pankaj Rao got. If Monali sells. Rupees three thousand six hundred fifty worth of flowers. How much commission will she get at the rate of fifteen percent? From above problem, we now understand the selling price of flowers is rupees three thousand six hundred fifty. We have given that the rate of commission is fifteen percent. Means she got rupees fifteen on rupees hundred. And the price of the flowers was rupees three thousand six hundred fifty. What was its commission on rupees three thousand six hundred fifty? So we take this commission as x. This is an example of direct proportion. As the one value increases, the other will also increases, or vice versa. Now arrange this information in this form. If we perform some calculation, we get the commission is rupees five hundred forty-seven rupees fifty paisa. Therefore, Monali gets rupees five hundred forty-seven point fifty as commission. Summary: In the lesson, we learnt selling price, marked price, discount, commission, commission agent. So that is all in this lesson, student. Till then, keep learning.